Hey guys, um, making this video in response to BP's, one of BP's latest videos here. He was checking out some things he found on uh, this worldwide telescope. I was checking it out too, and boy, they got some really crazy stuff you can see with this thing. You can see all over the place. Microsoft worldwide telescopes, what I'm using. I'm not sure if he's using the same thing or not. But he found some round, round balls that look the same as this, which is, boy, it sure is a strange looking anomaly. I found some all different colored ones in all different parts of the sky, and lots of these here too. These look like some kind of a, I don't know if it's a satellite image piece or what it is that they got, but they're all over this thing. Everywhere you look, you can find them. See, there's one, there's a dim one right there hiding. I'll zoom in on it, you can see it. See, it's some kind of a, I don't know if that's just a reflection of some kind off the telescope or what it is, but they sure do have a lot of them, or if they use those to make you think it's a reflection off the telescope to cover something up maybe but this is certainly a, a really neat program let's see where was the other one at in Taurus I wanted to look at so you can see that too let's see Taurus there we go Taurus here up here by this I don't know what this cluster of stars is it's really bright here when I zoomed on this earlier and I was messing around with it after I was watching BP's video I thought, you know, you look over here, you see this line, and boy, this looks an awful lot like that, that round blue orb he was showing, it, the texture of it looks just like this line, I don't know what this line is, but it's just kind of out here in the middle of space, has that same kind of an odd grainy texture, you can't really focus on it too well in this, this part of the space, but you can see right here in the middle of it is one of those orbs, right? That's one of those orbs he was talking about, only it's orange instead of blue. And it's got a line that runs off of it. You go over here, find this other orange orb, and it looks just like the other blue orb he was looking at, only it's orange. What in the world are those crazy looking orbs? They're all over the place out there in space. Look, here's another one right over here. Is it fit on it? It's another one of those. It's got that really odd texture. It sure looks like something doesn't look like a planet that's for sure so yeah this is the Microsoft worldwide telescope you can see all kinds of neat stuff on this you want to see a galaxy there you go there's a spiral galaxy to take a little closer look at those are cool that's pretty much what the Milky Way is a spiral galaxy spins around in a circle the Sun's moving through space and as the Sun moves through space the whole galaxy rotates around it in its contrail or whatever and its gravity keeps us trailing in here behind kinda in a little woo behind it like that so anyways yeah it's I mean it's almost endless the things you can look at with this there's all these different constellations and all these different areas and it get, it's got the zoom capability is just unbelievable it's pretty awesome really so there you go, BP. I just wanted to let you know there's other people that are looking at this too, and this is it's definitely a neat tool. I don't know how much of it they're letting us see and how much it, how much they're you know blocking out so we can't we can't tell what's going on with it, but it is definitely a neat it's a neat system. I'm glad they did it. So anyways, have a good day, guys. I just wanted to put this up there so that you can see there's all different kinds of colored ones. He's he's found the blue ones and. I don't know, is anybody else seeing these goofy lenses like this? This looks like some kind of a reflection of some kind of a picture, doesn't it? It's strange. So, anyways, there you go, guys. Have a good day. Hey, BP. Um, this is Josh. I wanted to throw a video up here and post a response to your video. Look at this thing that I found. All right, this is the same thing you've been looking at, right? In your videos, pretty much. It's got the spot in the center. Okay, now as far as I know, every picture of a UFO I've ever seen as far as, you know, NASA posts up and stuff like that always has this goofy spot in the middle, right? And usually they look white. Well, we've been finding these blue ones on here. I know I've been finding the same thing you have. So I'm going to take you here and I'm going to show you where, where this goes. Now this evidently goes out into space somewhere in a direction that we can't catch. We can't catch the beam. But you can obviously see this beam here, right? Alright, now you got this little this little orb or whatever you want to call it, UFO, I don't know, uh, in the middle of this beam. So now you back out of this beam, right? 
and you just climb right down here. Let's follow the beam. We'll follow the beam. I did this a minute ago and it just amazed me so I had to take a video of it to sh show you what I found because I know what you're talking about. So yeah, you follow the beam and look, it goes to another one of these orbs, right? Wow, isn't that amazing? And then there's another one of these pictures over here. I'm always seeing these little reflections of something on this program. So then you follow the beam. You follow, Now if you, if you focus into this beam, you'll notice the beam looks a lot like the little orbs. You see how it's got the little blue spots and speckles? You bring it back and you got, you look at that, you go right into another orb. And it looks like that's a reflection of this orb off of a lens or something. You see that, how there's like another line there and it looks like there's a reflection? I think we're seeing the reflection of this orb. Okay, and, and there's a lot of these all over the place in, in this thing, if you look. Let me follow it down again. Let's see, we'll follow it a little farther. And you come to another blue orb. Alright, and now you're going back into an unknown you know, void or whatnot. Now I've I've seen a lot of these coming off of large large suns like this. But this was this one here really caught my attention, so I thought I better take a picture because boy, this is exactly all straight in a line. This is in the constellation of Booties. Booties. Very interesting. Very interesting. So there you go. There's the second part of my contribution to this particular strange strangety you go to the the lowest star in booties and then you just follow it over and you'll find that line you'll find the orbs isn't that something that's just amazing all right see ya bye